Well, um, in the comments, you you um, you heard me say um, none is supreme but God. You know, <laughs> and the reason why I said that was because um, I heard a lot of Queen Mother and um, feeding off of Africa, and you know, to me, it's like. Um, you know, I'm a Christian, first of all, <laughs> so I'm a believe a little bit different, you know, and I mean, I guess it's OK to disagree, you know, but um, what what is going on here reminded me of a, um, a scripture in the Bible telling us like in the last days, it says, uh, now the spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times, which is like the last days, some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines mm -hmm. of devils. And to me, it's like, um, you know, a lot of people <laughs> worship their ancestors and stuff, but, and, you know, they all had to repent. There's only one God, you know, and, and that's who we should revere, you know, and, you know. What, but what makes you feel me. we don't, that's, sister? I'll, yeah. That's just for me. You know, I'll, I'll get on mute if you want to talk. I'll, I'll, I won't. You said get on mute. Uh, real quick, sister Anna, real quick before the queen speaks. Please, I don't want you to go down. Because I, I, I feel a little humbleness in you. I don't want you to go down. I want you to be edified. I want you to be edified. So please, if you got time, we have time. No, I just um, muted because you said that um, we shouldn't interrupt each other. So if she wanted to talk, I just, I, I muted. That's all. I'll try to be respectful to your panel. I asked a simple question. I said, what makes you think that we don't rever the most high God? No, I'm this not saying you don't. I'm not saying you don't. And I, I didn't make that way, assumption. Yes, that yes you, you did, sister. You but, said that you see a lot of queen mother and you see a lot of this. And you know that some people worship their ancestors and that it reminds you of a scripture of people being given over to seducing spirits. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's how you presented it. That's what I said. But I'm saying I didn't say that towards you. I'm saying that what, what I see and why I had wrote, um, none is supreme, but God. Now that doesn't mean that you don't, you know, I don't know your relationship with God, but I'm talking about the other things surrounding it from what I see, not from what you, not you individual. This is just my, my opinion on what I want to walk in. Just like you're giving, you know, you, you're allowed to give your opinion on what you may think of me, you know what I mean? Or, or what I'm saying. You know what I mean? I'm not faulting you. I'm just, you know, being honest with you concerning how I feel. That's all. Well, I mean, and I, I respect you being candid about your feelings. And I also respect that the fact that you know that they are just your feelings or Likewise. your opinion. So you, you come here and you're making assumptions. And it, 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 we we are a, a group of people, first of all, we, we definitely honor the most high God. Let me say that, not, not just God, because God is subjective, because there are many gods, but the most high God is who we are servants of. We have studied scriptures, we have traversed various schools of thoughts, and we are sound when it comes to the scriptures likewise and okay well if your sound sister is as sound as we are then you would understand what the background is and you would understand what is going on and let me be clear for anybody and, and these brothers can be a testament to that let me be clear for anybody who comes to this channel and when they see black men honoring a black woman that they feel is some kind of devilish act. Like, I, did, I, didn't, I did not that. say that. I'm yeah. not, I, I didn't say that, sister. You That's said that, you said that it, that it reminded you of a scripture being no, given I, over I'm to seducing spirits. That, so let me be That's clear. That's what you said, sister. I am not talking about that. I think that a, a man should honor a woman and likewise, you know, so that has nothing to do with, I'm talking about what we say behind it. It's like um, worshiping, you know, worship, not worshiping the woman, but I don't believe in that worshiping a woman, but I, I'm talking about 
uh, worshiping different spirits, other entities besides God. Now, I'm not, again, let me be clear. I'm not saying that's what you're doing. I'm saying that's what it sounds like to me. Not by right. the honor and I'm part. giving you clarity. And that's not what by I'm the trying honor to give part. you clarity of, of, because that's what it looks like to you. And mm -hmm. I was making my point in regards to somebody seeing black men honoring a black woman and placing her in a place of, of how they understand the scriptures to where she's supposed to be to where her her true birthright is to where she is in creation as well as in the cosmos what she well, is with my us, husband lord well as, without us outside of us so if you call your husband lord i mean what what's the difference i, I that's, don't that's exactly what i'm saying you're, why you're saying that why, why why are you not given over to seducing spirits by giving okay, your well, husband you're, not, gonna, of you're gonna, gonna i didn't say that i mean i didn't but, say it in the sense that like, i'm not putting words in your mouth you? i'm not putting words in your mouth i'm that, saying that, that i didn't what you said I didn't that say is what it you like said. you said okay. when we do it, it okay. when, when these brothers do it and I want to be clear what something that I want to say I have never told either one of these men that you you must address me like this you must do this brother can tell you how how I am in regards to titles and things like I'm so none of that stuff matters to me this is how these men and not even just these men hey, you're putting words saying, in my mouth I, 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 I wish you, you I wish you would let me finish. Your, 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 your I'm not putting words in your mouth. I'm giving you clarity because of what you said you thought was going on here. So I'm giving you clarity is what I'm doing. But I'm that's not what I thought. Clarity. What you're saying is not what I thought, sister. Well, I'm I'm giving you matters what what you did think was wrong, and so I'm giving you clarity. You know? here. You're, you're not saying because what I you thought. just told us that you thought that it was something that but reminded I'm not you of about a the scripture. I'm not we we keep that. going in a circle, sis. That's what you said. Okay, well, let's. Those are your words, word. and We're I'm giving you clarity it. as to what's going on here. And I can't get a sentence or two out without you jumping to the fence. You're not listening to for clarity. You're not listening to be clear to understand. You're listening to be defensive and to respond, and that's not productive. That's detrimental to the conversation i'm trying to give you clarity as to i'm sure i'm giving you clarity as to what is going on i told you i have never asked any of these men that they must address me a certain way that's not who i am but yet can anybody you lower, can you lower your tone a little any, bit no no ma'am 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 respect right respectfully i'm i'm very grown okay okay but i, I am too. i don't need you i don't need Do you, you acknowledge that i am too this is not it yeah it, 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 we well all i'm saying is can you go well, i'm willing to listen now what I'm i can do what i can, can do is continue what I can do is continue to speak in my passion. And how about this? If you have a problem with it, then you can always exit. Because yes, I'm, not a, I'm not just the guest on the panel like you. You're ridiculous. Now, <laughs> am I not repeating her words, what she said? Can I just say something real quick? <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Brother, 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 Ricky. Uh, brother Ricky, first, let me give you what, what title, what rank do you have in your position because i i don't care it's six people listening and this is something we're supposed to talk about private but i want i don't i, I don't want to keep calling you by your first name what rank do you have left? i'm an okay. i'm an i'm an ascended master say it again what title do you want me to call you Man, I'm not even worried about no. You can call me Ricky. It don't make no difference. Okay, I just, I see. Just, just, just real quick. Okay, you don't I'm make no difference. I know. I know. Yeah. I know. yeah. I just okay. Just hey, bat hey, battle angel. I'm a battle angel. General battle angel. Battle angel. Yeah. Battle angel. Yeah. So can, can, can I say something? Can I say something right quick, brother? Uh, I wanted to say something real quick. I already did. I, you know, I'm all bro. I just want to just say something real quick. Go ahead, right. brother. Go ahead. Spent, Hannah, if you're still here, I was trying to let you just calm down. We, she not, she wasn't saying anything wrong to you. You kept interrupting her. It would, it would have been a beautiful conversation if you just would not. If you would just put yourself on mute, like I, I just told you the rules. 
Like I just told you the rules. And the queen called you out on it, but you jumped to instead of being on offense, you, you jumped to defense and you couldn't be quiet. Like everybody in the chat, everybody who was watching right now just saw that. And we was being real nice. The queen told me to bring you up. And we was being super, super nice. I told you, if somebody mute, I mean, if you talk, we go to mute. And if we talk, you mute. But you kept interrupting the queen. You kept interrupting her. And then gonna try to control how I present, like, no, no, ma'am. See, and, and, and it, it, it. <laughs> Some sisters get things twisted when you tr when you talk to them respectfully, you know, but with just as much strength as uh, they may I... think that they're coming in and, and it's a problem, you know, or, or they seem that it, it's some kind of weakness. I'm just being respectful. I'm being cordial because I have positive conflict resolution skills. I can sit down and have a conversation. And I'm, I'm, I'm more than capable of articulating what my I mean and my intent. If you have it confused and you said it, that's what it seemed like to you. So I begin to give you clarity as to what was going on. She and you kept interrupting me and she saying, I'm putting words in your mouth. Ma'am, how am I putting words in your mouth? I, I'm, I restated you pretty much verbatim, pretty much verbatim. You know, and that's when you know that it's just <clears throat> there. There's something, you know. There's an underlying issue there. There's there's something there, you know, because you came here saying that oh, I see all this queen mother stuff. They they ain't even called me my lord, and you sitting up here telling me you bow down to a man calling him your lord, but you got a problem with two black men calling me queen mother. What's what's really going on? Stop and think about. You just said you call. I don't care if he's your husband or not. You call him Lord. They called me Queen Mother. And you got up here and say they they being seduced by spirits. It seemed like it's giving a script, got your scripture ready and everything to diagnose the situation. That wasn't right, Queen. She wasn't oh, right. You, you know I know. And that's why I said when you said about coming up here and when you said when you first said something about her being in comments, you notice I didn't say anything because I, what my response was going to be. Yeah, I saw it, but I didn't see it. I'm not even fixing it because I, I mean, come on, you know me. I already knew what it was going to be. But yet and still you chose to came up. OK, good evening. How you doing? Hope you find this well. And let you speak. You came she up here assuming that we didn't, we, we, we worship an ancestors and we got all this other stuff that's not written in the background that ain't nobody said that you haven't heard of, nobody not once say anything about the ancestors. We are in scripture. I don't know how long you've been on this live, but we've been on here for at least over two hours now. And every other live, that's what we build upon. So I know the Holy Spirit, there was nothing divinely inspiring or prophetic about your diagnosis because the spirit realm knows what we do over here and who we do it for and why they do what they do. These men honor me the way they do because they feel that the spirit of the most high is present within me. I know it. And you know it, it. It's sad that that sisters. I mean, you you you're not the first, and you won't be the last. I, I, at this point, I'm used to it, and it's sad. It's sad because I still do what I do for you, standing and 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 walking in this and making the sacrifices that I have to make. You know, see people. They, <clears throat> People are jealous of certain anointings, but they don't want to do what you have to do or when they is really presented to them and you understand what you have to walk through, how hot that fire is. What I chose to walk through for you, for mine, to be a living representative of this ancient beauty that is known as divine wisdom incarnate, what we descend from. And you call it devilish when a man 
can honor a woman, but when you honor a man, oh, it's I guess it's okay because you went to a courthouse and got a license, marriage license and um, involved the government in your union. And sold your state back to the your, your back to the state and let allow them to govern your marriage. You seem to think that it's better. People come up here with a with a high mindedness, and it's just it's it's just ridiculous. Got your little scripture and everything. Spirit ain't bit mo told you none of that, none of that. None of that. Queen Mother. Lord. Queen I Mother. wish I would, knowing who I am. Hold on, Brother Ricky. Knowing who okay. I am. Truly knowing. I, I wish a man would tell me to call, call him Lord. I wish I would. I wish I would. What? You proudly came up there. Same, same and said that. Same as that. Proudly abased. Proud. I'm okay with my turn. I'm, 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 I'm in love I'm, with your, with your, man, sister, please. This is not what you want. This is not what you can even comprehend. You know, just like that poem I posted uh, today that I, I shared with you, uh, 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 brother uh, Elijah General. And, and one part is say quotients aren't happy when they encounter the whole. They must admit that they are fractions extracted from a greater fold. They then see that they are the replicas and I am the mold. And I play the notes that their scales have yet to compose. And y'all be, y'all be, don't want to, don't want to walk it out. Don't want to do what it takes, but want to sit up and just be ugly and hateful to warn who 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 is daily sacrificing to walk in that light to carry that frequency so that frequency and vibration can still exist on this plane of existence you don't even understand what's going on here sister and we try to put it simple to you and others like you because y'all are a dime a dozen at this point self-righteous by your own understanding and it is but filthy rags before the one who sits above all but you want to come try and diagnose me sweet pip pick the beam at your own eye as the scriptures say before you try to come over here doing anything pick the beam at your own eye because it's big sis that big old lordship beam that you got sticking out your eye I call my husband Lord. So what what exactly are you saying then? Why why you got a problem with them calling me Queen Mother? Exactly. Why is that devilish? But you doing it ain't devilish. Same way they told Yeshua, you cast out demons in the name of Beelzebub. And he basically told him, I'm paraphrasing it, there's just but one science. So if that's how I'm doing it, how y'all doing it? It's because there is but one truth. And if we are truly followers of Christ, that your life will mirror your, that's the blueprint. So thank you, sister, for confirming that I am on the right path because you are, are, are the signs that, that are placed in the path to let us know these things. We know you walk amongst us and, and, and that's all I have to say about that. Uh, go ahead, brother. Well, you took the word right out of my mouth, right? Let's okay, just do that. Oh, 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 go ahead, oh, okay, go ahead, bro. Go ahead, bro. Go Go ahead, bro. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, T. Queen, that was so wicked. And for her to even tap out like she did, that was even more wicked. That was even more wicked for her to tap out like that. You should have gone, bro. Hold on, hold on, brother Ricky, mute your... Okay, okay, okay. She know doggone well, Queen, that she was not supposed to tap out like that. If you said, here's the exit, and she has already been able to come here to us, she know damn well she wasn't supposed to tap out like that. But she was. But she was, though. Because because 
And I know y'all understand what I'm saying because them demons know that they have to respect and do what the Holy Spirit tells them to. You're not going to come here and run this. If you have a problem with it, then you can exit. And that's what she did. It's always a spiritual warfare. It's always because you had to. Yes, ma'am. You had to because what you don't do is run nothing over here. Yes, ma'am. And that's that's what I was exactly what I'm saying, Queen. She, her being, her her personal soul, knew that she was not supposed to tap out, but the demons that's around her, hmm. in her, whatever. However, <laughs> they are in contact with her, they grabbed her by her hand, grabbed her <laughs> by her neck, and said, Abort. Abort expeditiously. If she's talking about the Lord, then she knows she wasn't supposed to get up out of there. But she had no other choice because she's been, she was led by some demons. Oh, you know, I know. <laughs> That's exactly and, what it was. And she was bogus. And I'm saying that on a physical level. I'm saying that on a hood level. I'm saying that on every physical manifestation that the Most High has ever manifested. She was 100% bogus. Because how she came up here, she, <laughs> you, you, you backed her up in the corner. She, matter of fact, she backed herself <laughs> in the corner already. She started. Exactly. Come, she came up here saying that she don't hear nothing but ancestors. We are. <laughs>